Hi, I'm Kathleen Coleman. I'm an MD and my specialty is maternal fetal medicine, the care of women who have high-risk pregnancies. I have always loved women's health, taking care of women, promoting good health for them, whether their pregnancies are high risk or not. And I continue to enjoy this practice after 40 years. I see all kinds of women from teenagehood to post-reproductive age. My specialty area within maternal fetal medicine is ultrasound for fetal reasons and also a gynecology. I love all aspects of seeing my patients for consultations and their ultrasounds. So we treat for a lot of women who have high-risk pregnancies due to medical issues such as heart disease, diabetes, hypertension, being overweight, and also for fetal disorders, and that could involve birth defects or growth disorders, or the history of preterm birth or multiple gestations, which is twin pregnancies and, and the like. I think that we do offer specialized procedures. We are pretty much cutting edge when it comes to ultrasounds for women and also for their babies. We offer three-dimensional ultrasounds for diagnosis, and not just for pretty faces. So we try to stay on the cutting edge for everything that we do, and that includes other procedures for genetic diagnosis as well. My approach to patient care is to take each individual, care for them from where they come from. I'm interested to know lots of things about the patient, not just the reason that they come here today, but their family unit, the environment that they live in, the religion that they may or may not have. All of these things help guide me in treating the individual woman. In our practice, and at least for me, I am very patient-centric which means that we have shared decision-making, which takes time on the part of both my patients and also for me. So we don't have very short consultations, you know, when I don't direct them necessarily with what I want them to do. Sometimes I have to respect patients' decisions that may not be the same as what I would want for them. So I'll always work with the patient to come up with what we think is the best approach for them. Our practice is a collaborative practice and a consultative one primarily with our referring OBGYNs. So we work very closely with our OBGYNs and also with other subspecialties, including endocrinology, cardiology, orthopedic surgery at times. So everything that we do is involving collaboration. In complicated pregnancies, the center of what we do is consultative and also sometimes treatment with medications. So for diabetes, we get involved in treating them with medications. For fetal birth defects, we may be doing various procedures or referring them to other institutions even outside of our state and for other types of treatment. There's a full range of things, including chorionic villus sampling, amniocentesis for genetic conditions. Genetic counseling may play an important role in treating some of our patients. When I have a first visit with a patient, it's usually for a consultation, and we go over complete medical history, social history, if there's an ultrasound, those results, and then lay out a plan for the care over the balance of the pregnancy. Even before patients come to see me, I am hopeful that they know why they're coming to see me and that they have thought about what they could get out of a consultation with me, what action plans they might expect for them to get the best possible plan for their pregnancy. I am often very hopeful that when patients come to see me that they have actually thought a lot about the conditions that need to be treated or the questions they have about management of the pregnancy if they Google things, if they go on social media, that's great. I'm happy to talk to them about what they have discovered and also lead them to very reputable social media and websites for them to get more information for themselves and their families following our consultation.